from different standpoints, from different angles, one and the same Atma, Brahma Vastu is unfolded so that the student can get that knowledge either by this means or that means whatever that appeals to the student. So now here, Jagataha Paramakaranam Brahma. The ultimate cause of the Jagat is Brahma is being unfolded. For which a method is adopted. Do you know why I have to do, do you know Brahman? For the time being, Brahman is unknown to us. Generally, how do you try to know an unknown thing? Is it not through the means of known things? With the means of known things, you try to know the unknown thing. Brahma is not known to us. But something is very well known to us. What is that? Samsara. Samsara, this Sukadukhapa Samsara is very well known to us. Now this Sukadukhapa Samsara is compared to a tree. When you see a tree, is it not that tree is very visibly clear to you? Unless you have what a eye defect. But do you see the roots of the tree? Do you mean to say roots are not there? Roots are why tree is there? This method is adopted. Samsara vriksha, the samsara compared to a tree, we can never miss. There must be a cause for that. Mula must be there. So for which the introduction to this third worldly, the sixth worldly, second chapter, third worldly, otherwise sixth worldly, I hope you know what is worldly. Worldly means creeper, but here creeper in the sense section. So second chapter, third section or sixth section from the very beginning. That is being given. What is that? Why? Yavaraja is unfolding further Brahma Sarupa in this worldly continuum as connecting Prasthavana Pastra. Mulava Dharana Eva. Mulava Dharana Eva. Mulava Dharana Yusha Syakriyate. Loki. Yatha Eva. Samsara Kaja Yusha Dharana Eva. Tan Mula Syakramana. Swarupa Avadidhar Ishaya Yam Shashti Valli Harapyate Yam Shashti Valli Harapyate This sixth valli, sixth section is being begun. What for? Brahmana Swarupava Vidharaishaya for with the intention of ascertaining the Swarupa of Brahma. For the for ascertaining the Swarupa of Brahma, this sixth worldly, sixth session is being started. By what method? What the method you are using? That method is given. Tulava dharane naiva, mulava dharanam vriksha sekriyate. Vriksha sya, in the case of a tree. Mulava dharanam, ascertainment that it has got what? Mula. Mula means the root which is not clearly visible. Ascertain how to lava dharanena by ascertaining to the what is to the to the what is it's called as panicles. Panicles mean in a tree or a plant 
a bunch of flowers hanging down. Bunch of flowers or fruits hanging down, it is called a panicle. Suppose in the cotton plant, and it is the fruit, that is fruits have got already yielded the cotton. The bunch of cotton hanging down. Or mulberries, mulberry, branch of bunch of mulberries hanging down. You are seeing these bunches, panicles called tulip. What do you conclude? This plant, this tree has got a root beneath the ground. Is it not? Are you seeing the root? No. And if without seeing the root, you have any roots are there. Are you wrong? Okay. Why? Tula is seed. It's branch of mulberry or whatever that is seed. So that tree, that plant must have the root. It is. This is the principle they are offering. You know samsara vriksha, it will be this fact. It must have necessarily a root. Tulava dharani maiva, mulava dharana, rikshasya kriyate. It is done in the case of what? A tree, rikshasya kriyate. Loke yatha, that is how in the world, when you see tula, you conclude there is a mula root of the tree beneath the earth. Evam, in the same manner, sausa arakarya vriksha avadharanena. In this manner, sausa arakarya vriksha avadharanena by ascertaining the vriksha in terms of manifestation of sausa. Being sausa, the stratukhatmaka existence that we are undergoing movement by movement is compared to what? A tree. And when it is there, that tree must have a root. That root is what? The Karyavesha, Avadharanena, by a certain moment, Tanmulasya. Tanmulasya means Tasya, Samsara, Tasya, Mulasya. The root of that samsara vishya. And what is that mula? Brahmana. It is what? Brahma. So that part. Don't start doubting whether Brahma is there or not. Samsara is there. Jagat is there. Brahma should necessarily be there. Brahmana. Swarupava didharaishya. With the intention, I mean, with the ichha, desire of ascertaining the true nature of Brahma, which is the root cause of what? Samsara Vriksha, this was the in the What is the purpose of this was From the known Samsara Vriksha arrived at unknown Brahma. That's it. Purva Moolaha Avaak Shakaha Eshaha Ashwathaha Sanatana Tadeva Shukram Tad Brahma Tadeva Shrutam Ujjate Tasmin Lokaha Shritaha Sarve Tad U Na Atteti Kashyana this samsara, first we should know samsara, it is described in the form of a figurative description. A tree means root is there, branches are there, foliage is there, all these are there. No? What are these corresponding aspects in the samsara vriksha? This samsara vriksha is like this. Urdva mulaha avakshaka. 
root is above, branch is up. <laughs> Absolutely, you know. You should not take the word Urdhva and Avad literally. Urdhva means above in the sense superior. Adha, below means superior with Krishna. Avad, below means low Nikrita. Nikrita. Superior. See, doesn't it people pray to God? Where do they look? Oh God! <laughs> oh God! Why do you look up? God is a man above. You don't look down. Oh God, you don't look down. Be someone with Krishna. High up! And then well, say, this samsara vriksha has got Urdhva Mumulaha. Its roots are where? Above, in the sense that it is, that is Utkrishta. The roots are something which are, that is, very highly, that is, are developed or pressure. Suppose you think of a tree without the roots, you go on cutting the, what is that, trunk. Tree will again. Cut the root, the root. So there is a very basis for the samsara. Urdhva Bhulaha. So this is not absurdity. By above we mean Uttrishta, exalted. The root cause of this samsara vishya is exalted. Avak shakha. Shakhas, branches, are avak, lower, nikrishta, inferior. And this samsara vriksha is compared to a tree. Which tree? Eshaha Ashwatthaha. Ashwatha. Pronounced properly. Some, some people from Gujarat have got a habit of Ashwatha. <laughs> I've heard this in the Avijis. They are chanting 15 chapters. I was a Billy Pallet for two and a half years. Every day I am hearing the chanting in the Avili. Avili means private Krishna's temple. I said, Parda Bhagavan. <laughs> you can't have in Darshan except for the specified timing. So is that Arati, this, etc. Otherwise, no. I think in Vrindavan, there is one temple, Krishna's temple. That the custom is that. So, what they do? They will not allow you to have direct this sight of the deity continuous. What will do? A carnal will bring it, remove it, bring it, remove it. If they say it happened to us, then what they say? What devotee have a high level to so much. Absorbed in Krishna, the seeing it and and he started going behind his idol. <laughs> idol also started going. So the custom is that idol should not move up. <laughs> so again, again, this incident should not get repeated. So bring the obstacles. Bring, bring the gun. No, it's actually, they are doing. Somebody expect me. Somebody don't want that. This is the reason why they are doing it. So that what is it? Ashwatha. So I am hearing, I was hearing that Aswasta, Aswasta, Aswasta. What is people chanting in the Aswasta? You know, Aswasta is a sick person. And not only sick, serious. Sick, sick. Seriously, sick person is gone, Ashwatha. So that is the, so Ashwatha. Ashwatha tree is pimple tree, not barren tree. Pimple tree. Why it is called Ashwatha? Shvaha na sthata idi Ashwatha. 
tomorrow that tree is going to be there, no guarantee. It may be there, but no guarantee. Shwaha, tomorrow, no sada may not be there in the Ashwatthana. Since when it is there, sanadana, niranta chirantana, vidityaha, avinashi, indestructible in the sense until you gain the knowledge. Until you gain the Atma Jnana, this samsara vriksha cannot be destroyed by any other means whatsoever. Tadeva Shukram, that alone, what is that alone? That Urdha Buddha, the root which is superior. So, what's that logic? Buddha, Tadeva Shukram. Shukram means bright. Bright in the sense, Nyati Swarupa, very knowledge principle, Chaitanya Tattva, Tat Brahma, that is what is called as Brahma. Tadeva, that Brahma itself is called as Amrutam Uchyate. For Amrita. Amrita means Avinashi, indestructible. Amrita means Do you know Samsara Vriksha? You may not know as Vriksha, but you know as Samsara or not. Oh, come on. You know this much. Three. For a tree, root is indispensable or not? Agreed? Now, your for your samsara means your sukha dukha atmaka existence. What is indispensable? Without which it cannot be that all. No roots, no tree. Accepted? No roots, no tree. What is that principle if no that sukha dukha atmaka samsara is not there? How do you experience Sukha Dukkhas? Do you experience without Chaitanya? Huh? And this Chaitanya is not there, there is no Sukha Dukkha experience. No samsara, Riksha. You understood? Where are you going to hunt Brahman? These are, see, these are not simple things. This is what Vedanta is. Not that text after text, you go on studying, etc., etc., etc. This is what it is. Do you undergo Sukha, Dukha? Ah, Sukha, Bhaji, where are you? Dukha? Yes. Do you suffer? Yes, no? How do you know? What made you experience that? That is the Can you escape that? Once you know this point, each and every experience of ours, Sukha, Dukha, Mana, Apamana, Shita, Ushna, Kama, Krodha, Loha, Moha, Mada, Masala, Janma, Marana, all the experiences we have to go are not, huh? are known because of what? That is Brahma. Buddha. Root. Switch on the TV serial. <laughs> we have got some information, <laughs> but mind is still preoccupied by samsara, riksha, only, and not centered by in the world. That is why first Vedanta hammers sadhana chatushtaya sampati viveka vairagya. 
withdraw your mind from the present preoccupation of this, re-divert it to this root. What is that? Chaitanya. Easy. How? You know what is the raw material you require? Any blessed experience. Presently, your mind is preoccupied in the Nama Rupa of that experience. Good, bad, indifferent, giving Sukha, Dukkha, etc. Vedanta says, pierce through it. What enables you to experience this? Chaitanya. Focus your attention. So that in sixth chapter of Bhagavad Gita, <coughs> dhyana is told. What happens? We sit for meditation. Everyone wants to meditate, but what is meditation? Nobody knows. <laughs> Nobody knows who. Satisava is to say. Those who learn meditation and those who teach meditation are fools. <laughs> Both of them are fools. <laughs> meditation is what? Chintana. Are you not doing chintana? Moment by moment? Question is of what? You know. So that's it. Withdraw from that chintana, redirect where? To Chaitanya. You know what is this where? Asangatva, Aditatva, detached things. And where in sixth chapter of the Gita, where Lord Krishna is talking of jnana, first and foremost obstruction is Vishaya Chinta. Our mind running after the Vishaya Shabda, Sparsha, Rupa, Sagarta. So now, what Lord Krishna said, bring it back. Bring back the mind from the fishes. How will you do that? Bhashyakara comes to our rescue. He says, Abhasi Kritya. That Vishaya should be reduced to Abhasa. Abhasa means what? Appearance. Truly, real Vishaya is not there. It appears to be there. So what do you do? You go to the very basis of that Chaitanya which makes you aware of the wishes. Because of it, to know the wishes. Abhasi Krutya. Otherwise, bringing back is not possible. But the mind has already run after the wishes. Then we say Sutta Brahma. So that means where is this now? That's what I said. What is the raw material? Any blessed thought, blessed experience means any blessed thought. From the Nama Rupa of the thought, go to the Adhishthana, basis of Chaitanya, basis called Chaitanya. I say, Tasmin Shitaha Sarve Loka. All lokas, fields of experiences, tasmin, tasmin means tasmin brahmani, in that brahmani, shitaha, center. How is it? Sarvi loka means big lokas. In our Shastra Chatur Dasha Bhuvana. Fourteen Lokas. Or other way, other category is three Lokas. Same thing. All this. So they are center. Loka means field of experience. 
Bürger, Bumi. Field of experience. Field of experience has to have experiences. Experience is possible because of sector. Now come on. All the cars are centered where? In Chaitanya Sarupa. How? Just uh, as, as Delhi uh, this. Superimposed snake is centered on the road. Sarpa, big sarpa, delusive, not real sir. is centered where on the road. Like that. Entire samsara is centered where? Brahma, this Brahma. Tadu Kashchana Navatevi. That Brahma, no one can transgress. No one can exist without that Brahma. You may say, no, 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 no. I am an exception. I am landed down from where? Heaven. So that I am. Independent of Brahman. I give weight to your statement. Acha. You are independent of Brahma. Is it not? How do you know? You know it or not? You are independent. How do you know? What made you know? That is Brahma. What made you know you are independent of Brahma? That is what? Brahma. You can't escape Brahma. Sarve lokatadu na devi. Mean. Nothing can transgress with Brahma in the sense. Nothing can exist independent of Brahma. Independent of Brahma, nothing can Eta Dvaita. You have kept that phrase all the time. Nachiketa, you ask about Atma Brahma, this is what it is. This is what that Atma Brahma is. Let us see the Bhashya. Now you will come to know the literary excellence of Bhashyakara. He simply explains, describes what Samsara Vriksha. What are all the details here? He goes it through very very that from a literature standpoint is a masterpiece. This paragraph that we are going to say is a master. The problem of us is we don't know something. <laughs> we don't know something. What is that problem? Those who know something, the literary is the literary piece. <laughs> Purudhvam Moolam Yad Tad Vishno Ho Paramam Palam Asya Iti Saha Ayam Avyakta Di Savaranta Samsara Vruksha Purudhva Moola The word Urdhva Moola is being this explains. Urdhva Moola. Literally it means what? The one who has got the roots above. See? This sometimes is Christian missionaries. This is see, see, see. What your Shastra have observed? <laughs> Root above branches, they bring a picture also. Somebody told me that Trivana was a yatra in there, no? That plain people that come in, the thousands of them. There are these people also are there. See, see, some people they get. See, see, see. How Shastra are there. So then, roots above branches, they not the meaning. Urdha Buddha. Urdham Moolam Yat What is that Moola? Tad Vishno Paramam Padam That That is the root above which is superior, exalted, do you know what it is? Namely, 
Vishno ho paramam tat. Highest abode of Vishnu. Don't run to Vaikuntha. From where did this Yamaraja bring the phrase Vishnu ho paramam padam? Already has been. One, three, nine. One, three, nine. Yes to Vidyana Vana. Vidyana Sarathi Yastu Mana Praglahava Naraha Sodhana Paramatnoti Sad Vishnu Ho Paramatma. So there is no Vaikuntha there. It is not Vaikuntha Vasi Vishnu. But the Parabrahm already is there. That is what is that? Vishnu Ho Paramatma. Means here Vishnu stands for Ho Parabrahm. So that is the only word. In the Kodavu and very clear it is, it is even the basis of Brahma, Vishnu, Eshwar. So Trinity is also in the creation. The basis of that is Adhishtana, Parabrahma. Padam. Asya iti. Asya. Of this, what is that Asya? Samsara, Vrikshas. What is Samsara, Vrikshas? Description in Saha Ayam Avyaktadi Stavaranta A to Z of Samsara Beginning from Avyakta Avyakta is unmanifest condition of Jagat. See, every day morning you wake up. When you wake up, every day you go to KG class to learn ABCD. What you had yesterday night before you say, you sleep. Where were you in between these two? Yesterday you slept and now you woke up. In between when you are sleeping, very manifest. But when you woke up, as an individual you are manifest. Means you were in an unmanifest condition, a dormant condition, avyakta sarup. Vyakta means clear, manifest. No vyakta, not clear, not unmanifest. Like see, a seed, avyakta, tree, which is born of seed, is what? Vyakta, manifest. Sayam. Avyaktadi, the beginning from Avyakta, unmanifest condition of Jagat, otherwise also called Maya, or other word is Prakriti, Maya, Prakriti, Avyakta, these are Paryayavachaka. Paryayavachaka means synonym. So, Samsara, Avyaktadi, Sthavaranta. Anything with any gross thing in the world, mountains, trees, etc., all these things. Samsara Vriksha, that's Samsara Vriksha. Udva Mudaha has got a root which is superior. Above means what? Which is superior. The question is why this is called Vriksha? Etymology, the derivation of the word Vriksha is given. Why tree is called Vriksha? Vriksha Hacha Vrashchanat Why is called Vriksha Vrashchanat? That which is available for Vrashchanat. Vrashchanat means cutting that which can be cut. Can you not cut the vriksha? Means it can be cut and destroyed. Vrashya, Vrashya. So, 
now we know this one. This samsara is compared to a vriksha. Why is samsara is compared to vriksha? Just as a tree can be cut, so also samsara can be cut means ended. Hope is there or not? Some hope is there. How much will they get there? But it is possible. We have to work. So that can't just do this. That is what? Nothing can be done. See, everyday sleep should tell us freedom from samsara is possible. In sleep, samsara vriksha is there. Is that dormant condition, not manifest. It is not in the manifest condition. But its manifestation is curved or not. Is what you do. The root cause also you remove. In sleep, root cause is there. What is the root cause? Avidya. Remove the avidya, the root of the samsara, which is this secondary root of no, not the primary root of Brahma. So this is what samsara viksha is not. So now, this samsara viksha is described. The real start, the literary piece of Shakra itself. Let's say the, the very big paragraph will stop in between. Otherwise, <laughs> by the time you read, the class will be over. Janma Jara Marana Janma Jara Marana Shokadi Janma Jara Marana Shokadi Aneka Anarthasmaka Aneka Anarthasmaka Of the nature of having many calamities Anartha You know? क्या अनर्थ हो गया? What do you mean by अनर्थ? What is अर्थ? अर्थ means not money. That's okay. जनरल मीनिंग ये that which you seek. अर्थ है ते, प्राप्त है ते, that you seek is called as अर्थ. Money you seek or not? Yeah, that's what is called अर्थ. Anything that you seek, I want. That is what is अर्थ. पुरुषार्थस. Four things sought by them. It is a Purusha. Now here, Anartha. What is the Anartha? If you don't want those things which you don't want, what are those things you don't want? Which give you sorrow. What are things you want which give you joy? So Anartha. So that means unwanted things. Anartha means what? That which is not sought after, that which you don't want. So now, its nature is anega anarthatmaka. Not one calamity is, not one unwanted thing. Anega, many, what are those? Janma, jara, marana, shoka, adi, etc. Adi, samples are given. Janma, Birth. You want? Yes or no? I you celebrate birthday, etc. etc. <laughs> when we enter this world, what do we do? Smilingly we come, huh? Crying we come or not? And you don't want that. You don't know. Before birth, this guy was there. Who? How many months? Nine months. The most torturous condition. If you got a doubt, read Adhyatma Ramayana Kishkinda Kanda. That is Sampati. Sampati is brother of Jatayu. So 
So these the youngsters no? they know will reach who sun, Surya. And they started the flight. Flying up, 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 up. They started coming near the sun. By the heat of the sun, they were all, they were to get burned. Then what Sampati elder brother did what? To protect the younger brother, he spread his wings. Jatayu got protected, but Sampati lost his wings. Fell down. He fell down near the hermitage, ashram of a sage called Chandramamuni. Chandramamuni was well known to him, he was a friend he was. Sampati, Sampati, what is your life? What happened? So this is what has happened. So then he says, look, this samsara is like that. In that context, he describes the status of a fetus in the mother's womb from the time of conception up to nine months. At stage comes, this that means now when they become a child now, it gets the memory of all past life and finds all that accomplished, all this is just futile. It's of no use. And I am starting my game afresh. It develops by No more this samsara. Moment I am born, I will think of Vishnu and get free. <laughs> get free from where? Samsara. The delivery trauma starts. <laughs> and the child is born. Total blackout of what was. <laughs> and again, start with good old again. Chandra Mahamudhi gave to develop uh, inculcate Vairagya in the mind of Sampar. So that was Janma, desirable or undesirable? Undesirable. Otherwise you know you won't cry at all. Jara, old is desirable. You visit any old person, they give it to confidence. <laughs> monkey, monkey. <laughs> yeah, monkey, 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 monkey. Most of the dangerous condition. He has got so many desires, but can't fulfill. Anybody there? Who is that person who came? <laughs> and these people have no time. I want all this thing. She was in a glass of water. Difficult to get. See, the wife says, Why? I want to become old now. You go. <laughs> you, you go and you and go and get the water. Why you wipe the water from me? So nice. So old, old. Okay. Yeah. Marana, don't ask it. It's all the such a sorrow. Shoga sorrow. Pratikshana. Sorrow, sorrow. Adi. So you fit in the gap now, etc. <laughs> all the experiences are what? So other undesirable only. Anathatmakaha. Anathatmakaha of the nature of all unwanted things. Now tell me. Yes or no? Samsara is full of these or no? You have verified. Huh? <laughs> Don't. No, I said, no. Do I say? You have verified. Samsara is what? Janma, Jara, Marana, Shokadi, Anika, Anar, Atmaka. Pratikshana. 
अन्यथा स्वभाव प्रतिक्षण एवरी वुमेन अन्यथा स्वभाव में चेतिस संसार में निवर्दा सी सो यू थॉट दैट बट समथिंग एवरीथिंग नाइट इन प्रॉब्लम्स व्हाट सॉर्ट आई वांटेड व्हाट इट व्हाटेवर आई वांटेड आई गोट हैप्पी नो बाय द टाइम यू से आई एम हैप्पी फ्रैक्चर इन द लेग सो अन्यथा सो प्रतिक्षण मूवमेंट सिंधु दिस इज नॉट सिंपली लिस्टिंग थिंक एंड वेरीफाई एंड देन फाइंड आउट वेदर दिस संसार इज वर्थ रनिंग आफ्टर एंड इफ यू आर कन्विंस दैट दिस इज नॉट वर्थ रनिंग आफ्टर बी बोल्ड इन आफ्टर अबाउट आ this sauce that is why bhashya karan chatra has to say that yamaraja is telling for that purpose pratikshanam anyatha swabhava it changes movement by movement continue maya mari chi budak gandharva nagaradi vad maya mari chi दुष्ट नष्ट स्वरूप अवसाने उदक Which water? Maya Mari means mirage in a, a blazing desert. You see as if what is that? Water is that, or river flow is that, etc. We can see from the highway on the afternoon you are driving, and at this time you feel as if patches of water, sir. There is no water there. समान दर का वाटर पर इट एपेस्ट टू बी सो माया मनी ची उधर का ट्रू और नॉट नो बट योर परसेप्शन यस इट एपेस्ट टू बी माया मनी ची गंधर्व नगर आदि मत गंधर्व नगर इस पर जो है सिटी ऑफ गंधर्व आस नॉट एक्चुअल सिटी इज नॉट देर The patterns of clouds. See what you do. Evening, when the sun is going to set, you go to a open area. Beaches are covered, and what you can sit and go on watching, or hill station. Clouds are there. Go on. You have nothing else to do. Okay. If you have some appointment, nothing will be there. Only clouds you see. You have nothing else to do. Go on looking at the. You find patterns. Oh, castles is there. The flag staff is there. Army is there. Or the rows of shops are there. And then you find it. As if you are here. More you see. You are more you get coming. Oh, that is that. It is called a Gandharva Nagar, a figment of your imagination. There is no city there, Gandharva. But appearance, the illustration you get. We are away from your daily. Just we are relaxed and sitting with different colors, lots of different colors. दृष्ट नष्ट स्वरूप नेचर इज वॉट दृष्ट नष्ट आई सॉरी बट इट इज वॉट इज मीन इट इज लाइक दर्शन समय प्रतीयत एपियर्स टू बी दी वेन यू सी 
Suppose you are looking at a Gandharva Nagar and you suddenly heard a honking of a car, very close. You look at it and say, okay, you see, clouds are there, but your imagination is gone. The pattern is gone. Drishta, Nashta, Sabhavatva. Darshanai, Sabhaye, Eva Pratiyate. It is seen, though, only when at sight. You observe Viraj water. And you see that uh, really it is Drishta, Nashta, Sarupatva. Avasane cha, at the end, Vruksha was Abhavatmakata. Like a tree which is cut, no more tree, so also this samsara compared to Gandharva Nagara, Marichi, Udaka is not there. Means this samsara riksha is there so long as you undergo its experience. Truly, it is not. It cannot continue for ever. Thank you. 